Welcome to Northwind Computing's Learn WordPress in about three minutes video series. In this video, we're going to learn how to replace an image that's formatted in two columns on a specific page. And so the first thing I need to do is bring up that page. So I'm hovering over the main menu for pages and then over onto all pages. And I'm right clicking, bringing up um, the bring up the link in a new tab. And so I'm going to that tab. And then I'm going to simply select the page in question, which happens to be the home page. I'm going to click edit. And that will bring up the current page that needs to be edited. So the first thing to do to swap out an image is simply to get rid of the old image. And uh, I just click on that and there's an edit uh, option and then there's a delete. So I'm just going to click the delete and get rid of that image. Now, getting rid of the image leaves the short codes for the column formatting. And so rather than cleaning all this out and starting all over again, I'm going to place my cursor right between the end and beginning brackets of the uh, start the column and the end the column short code. And this just goes on and on and on because here's the short code for the start of the second column. And you'll see the same kind of thing just continues on uh, according to how many images I have. So make sure the cursor is right there, and I'm going to simply put in the, the new uh, replacement image in that place. So I'm clicking upload slash insert. That brings me to the first um, media selector pop-up window. And so I have a choice of a uh, number of things. I can select a file from my computer. Notice that my computer tab is highlighted. I can go to the gallery, which are images associated with this page already, but I don't want to do that because they're already there. So I happen to have the image in the media library. I've already uploaded it. So clicking on media library, I'm going to find the image and clicking on show once I've found the image. Now, you might want to put in an alt text because this is uh, a little bit of an SEO hack, which is... Uh, really nice to have and they even give you a little hint as to what you might say about the image but you just want to say um, whatever the image is and whatever you think that people on search engines are looking for and so you just want to put something in here okay that's a nice image um and so you need to make sure in this case that the alignment none button is selected, not left, not right, not anything else, but none. And in this case, I want to insert the image as a full size image showing the size 300 by 300 pixels. And so I don't have to do anything else. I'm really done. And I just click insert in the post. And so there is the new image right there. And so that's really it. I'm really done. I can preview to make sure that um, my little swap out worked. And it certainly did. So I'm going to close the, I'm just going to exit right out of the preview window. You can't save it. So I'm going to exit it. And from here, I can simply uh, uh, update and post this edited page to my website. And that's really all there is to that. 